Robert, how would you describe this heat to everybody at home? <laughs> the what? How would you describe this heat to everybody at home? It's uncomfortable, but hey, I love it, though. Does it, does it force you to kind of focus in and, and be like, you know, you've got to really mentally be there? Yeah, to, to get mentally strong for this kind of weather right here. Because really, heat takes some stuff out of you, but you got to keep your focus on. I mean, at the same time, knowing this is going to be the weather or similar weather for some games, does it help? I mean, you can't really replicate this if you're not in it. Does it help to kind of sort of see Oh, yeah, because I know last year it did because uh, last year some of the games they said it was hot. I was, I was chilling. It was, I was good. I, mean, I was good. Right. What's your role going to be, I guess, in the defensive front? It looks like you're, you're kind of the nose tackle right mm -hmm. now, it looks like. Just hold the dude I was recruited to do. Just hold the middle down, feet double team, do what I do. How's, how different does it feel with some of the weight loss? Do you feel a lot more comfortable? I feel amazing. More mobile? I feel amazing. Like this is probably the best I ever felt because I think before then I used to gain weight every off season, but now I just shedding all this weight. I feel like I'm back to seventh grade, coop. How much you lose? Ooh, like 40, 45. Are you where you want to be? Are you still trying to lose weight, or are you I got, right where you want to be now? I got to lose 20 more, and I'll be good. Oh, all right. Yeah. What's, you just stay out in this heat another five minutes. Heck yeah, this heat, this heat gonna take you right out of me. I tell you that. Yeah. With the new three four, with you lining, it looks like you're lining up beside Marv and Corey a lot. I mean, that's a pretty powerful kind of trio in the middle there. How much yeah. impact can y'all have? A lot, because deep. I feel like the defensive line is probably the most important part of the defense. So I know we doing our job. Is everything gonna come easy? Is it any of a more of a transition, or is it a different transition? What you're doing right now in practice, as opposed to what you were doing last year? Yes, because um, like last year, I just felt like more gassed, like more quickly. But now it's just I can last longer than I have, so I'm just making a real big impact for me at least. When is the last time you were kind of at this weight? Dang, it's all been. It's been a long time. I tell you that. It's probably been probably about eighth grade. Mm-hmm. What did, you do? Sorry. what did you do to get there? What was some stuff you just, cut out your diet? Or just eating right, you? really. Just mm -hmm. eating right and the workouts and then do some on my own. I'll be, everything just started going down from there. Did you know you were going to have to lose weight when you got to college? Or were you just like, ah, I'll be fine? At first I was like, ah, I'll be fine. <laughs> but then as more as I came here and I seen how Odell was just pushing his players, I was like, yeah, I got to drop this weight. And then it was harder than I expected, but I got it done. Though. So in the, in the off season, you put some on social media. I think it's like a whiteboard that had things that people had said mm -hmm. about you and your mm -hmm. weight. I guess how much yeah. motivation was that for you? During it the was a lot because just because the weight, everybody just put me down, really. But no, I knew I knew what I could do. So I mean, I, I knew I could lose the weight. So once I lost the weight, now I can really show what I can do. Then yeah. just you know, off season workouts and this first week of practice, how much of a difference have you felt kind of in stamina with the weight loss? Good. Like, I feel like last year, I, I, mean, I couldn't even tell you how many plays I could go without getting tired, but shoot, I can, shoot, my stamina done went up. I can last about as long as you can think. What kind of mentality do you have to have if you're just going to be a guy that's going to have to take on double teams and, and open up things for your teammates? You got to have a different type of mentality because now I know a lot of people that can't, they can't take that almost every play, especially at nose, where it's bound to happen every play. So really just a, you got to have really a dog mentality to play that position. We got a chance to see, obviously, with you and Corey and Mark mm -hmm. did you do last year. Who are some of the other guys that maybe some of the younger guys are, mm -hmm. who are stepping up behind you right now? I think every, I feel like every young guy in our position group is making progress, really, because you can't go wrong with Coach Odell. So he's going to get it out of you. So he's been getting out of them, and they've been showing good stuff. How important is it going to be for those guys to continue to, to elevate their game? It's going to be really important. Because you know you can't play the same people the whole game, so it's gonna be looking good. They they learning and everything's going smooth. Who's emerging as maybe a leader for you guys on the defensive side of the ball? I mean, maybe more than one guy. Anybody kind of rising to the occasion? Um, I think shoot. I think our whole everybody lead on the starting lineup, but you know, it's like Marv, people like that just take charge and help the leaders. How often do you go up against Dante? And what do you see from him? I think I'm gonna go. Against Dante, like I ain't go against Dante in one on ones yet, um, cause I work more at center. But I, he gonna be a ball. I tell you that y'all y'all gonna see something. Everybody says that about him. Mm. What is it about him? I mean, it's you guys just, are all 
here at Florida State. Yeah. They're all ballers. Mm -hmm. What makes him even different as a freshman? I mean, it's just what he's doing as a freshman. Like he just brings some like this, like a dog mentality. Like he just wants to finish. He just wants, he wants to like to, he wants to succeed bad. That's that's what I can see. He wants to see real bad. But he doesn't like mind embarrassing you if he puts you, not you personally, but mm -hmm. someone if he puts you on the ground. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that's the kind of mentality we need yeah. on the old line because, I mean, we got it, but he, that's him right there. That's Dante. That's Dante. And last year to this year, really, just the offensive line as a whole, what difference have you seen going against him in practice? It's big. It's a big difference. I feel like they're making a lot of progress, really, a lot of progress. Just getting stronger, knowing the game better. It's big progress. Thank you, boy. I need to turn this fan back on. <laughs> Shit. Go one more for Cooper. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We're good, man. Thank you, man.